find the critical numbers of f and here my f of x is equal to negative 1.5x squared plus 5x minus 5. So remember, the critical numbers are the places where either f prime of x is equal to 0 or f prime of x does not exist. So to solve f prime of x equals 0, I need to find f prime first, and f prime of x will be negative 1.5 times 2x plus 5. So f prime of x is negative 3x plus 5. So now I try to solve negative 3x plus 5 is equal to 0. But the minuses actually cancel. And so my solution x equals 5 thirds. I also need to see is there anywhere that f prime of x does not exist? Because I could also have these f prime of x DNE critical points. But in this case, the answer is no, because we're dealing with something that is always continuous. We're dealing with a quadratic polynomial. The only critical point I have is at x equals 5 thirds. It also asks me to use the second derivative test to determine whether this is a uh, local max or a local min. So the critical point at x equals 5 thirds tested with the second derivative test. Remember my first derivative was equal to negative 3x plus 5 and my second derivative then is equal to negative 3. So if I plug x equals 5 thirds into the second derivative I will have f double prime of 5 thirds. This is a constant function so I get negative 3. The second derivative is negative. So by the conclusion of the second derivative test, we can say that f of x has a local maximum at x equals 5 thirds.